Welcome. In this video, I'll be explaining the equalizer. But before I proceed, I would like you to subscribe to my channel, like, share, follow for more. Just turn on the notification bell to get more updates and more and more videos like this will keep coming. So when you do that, uh, thank you very much. My name is Ben and I am popularly known as Ben Lead, an official Ben Lead to some people. All right, so let's dive deep into what we have for today, which is the equalizer. If you've not watched my previous video, I would like you to do that. I released video on previous blocks, which is a video for compression, video for effects, video for amplifier. So go back to watch those ones so that you can follow along. All right, without any further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so what the equalizer does, it, it affects each and every band or the frequency of your tone. Now, when you play a particular note on your guitar, it tends to stand on a frequency better than the other. When you play on the first fret strings on your guitar, you get to note that it sounds kind of bassy in nature. That's because the tone tends to resonate around 120 to 750 or 1500 kilowatts. That's why you are getting that bassy sound. The advanced sound system we have now projects everything, even the bass, the mid, and the highs. We can use this equalizer to affect the way your tone sounds. So let's take, for example, we are trying to set the bass area of our guitar to be boosted. So we can use the equalizer to do that. And if we take note, the lower frequencies or the higher frequencies of your tone, your guitar is not coming up as you want it to. You can use the uh, equalizer to affect that. So now, how do we use the equalizer? The 120 hertz and the 250 hertz is used to affect the base area. The 750 hertz and the 1.6 kilohertz here is used to affect the mid range of your frequency, your tone, your guitar tone. So the 3.2k kilohertz and the 6.4k kilohertz is what you use to affect the treble or which is otherwise called the high frequency of your guitar. Alright, so how do you do that? You can use each of this knob now to adjust the first three of this equalizer. By tweaking this, you get to affect the first one here. Okay, okay, so I was wondering why it wasn't working. It's because my equalizer is turned off. Now you have to use your select to turn it on. So once it is on, you can use each of this knob now to adjust your frequency as it is. All right, so these knobs here, we adjust the first three. How do you adjust the next three? You do that by clicking on this. Then you adjust it still using the three knobs here. You notice that the arrow is now pointing to the right. So when I do that to go back, you notice that the arrow is pointing to the left. So it means I'm affecting only the first three here. And while if I click again, I'm affecting the next three. So you can do that to adjust your equalizer and get the tone you want. All right, so that's all we have here for the equalizer and I hope you enjoyed the video so far. Uh, in the next video, we'll be explaining what is called noise gates and how to use it. Stay tuned. Thank you.